Hi there and welcome back to the Bald Man Motors. So in today's video, I'm in my basement and we are going to be cleaning some floor mats. Now, in my C55 review video, you may have noticed that when I talked about it having AMG floor mats, mine are actually just normal Mercedes ones for W203. So to fix that, I had ordered some on eBay and got them and cleaned them up and they were disgusting when they came here. And so I cleaned them up and they look amazing now in the car and are actually the right AMG part that was supposed to be in there. So I also happen to have another set of W210 E55 floor mats. Now I already have a set in my car, but uh, I picked this set up a little while ago and these things are not made anymore by Mercedes. So to get a factory original E55 floor mats, they're around two to $500 on eBay when they occasionally pop up. They're pretty hard to find. Most of the ones you'll find in the market right now are knockoffs made in Turkey or China. So I'm going to do my best to actually clean these up and salvage them and uh, hopefully put them to good use. So let's get into it. And we're going to clean this one and this other one that has the E55 on it. And these things are just absolutely gross at this point. I mean, this is like super dark. So what we're gonna do, take those. Now, I have two sets of rears. This is probably the one that came with it, but uh, threads are pretty messed up over here on this edge. So I think we'll save these for a, another day if I really need them. And we will clean up these here. See the backs, okay, most of the backing. You'll find most of your backing almost always comes off of these. This one's not quite as much. All right, so let's go ahead and clean this one here. So I'm going to start it off by just spraying this around the edge. I probably should be wearing some latex gloves, but I don't have any. All right, so we got the drill. So I'm gonna go ahead and just run it on uh, low speed for now. We're gonna go ahead and use the steamer and start working on this while the rest of the cleaner kind of soaks into the mat. It's already looking a little bit better, but obviously all that dirt's still in there. We'll have to wash that out. All right, it's already starting to show more. Let's go ahead and hit some of this edge. You can see, the minute I hit it, starts to brighten it up. So now we're gonna rinse this thing out. Oh wow, so much garbage coming out of this thing. I wasn't able to get quite everything out of it. I mean, for 20 something year old formats, take these scissors, I've already started here a little bit. And uh, so if we cut these off, just like that, nice, nice and easy. So after the first initial haircut, uh, there's still quite a few little hairs like right around in here. Some of the threads are coming up and that's where the uh, torch comes in. So we have a very little flame and you can see right here, if I just run it real quick, just burn those hairs off. The backs aren't too bad. There's some stain right there on that corner. Um, really the driver's side mat right around in here. And there's some up in that section right there as well. So what I'm going to do is uh, I just got back from a drive. I got frustrated. I've washed these things like six times and I thought it could get it to come out a little bit better than that. But anyways, took the old uh, W210 E55 for a spin, put a smile back on my face. And uh, I also stopped by picked up this uh, shout here triple acting so what I'm going to do is uh, continue over the next few days to keep spraying all of the border trim so overall they're not in the best condition I'd call these a solid uh, I don't know 60% if I didn't have uh, floor mats in my car I would take these anyways all right let's go ahead and uh, get to the giveaway section and one of the reasons I was frustrated is because I am giving away this set of floor mats and I wanted to make sure they were as clean as possibly could be that's option number one coming in the giveaway maybe you already have a nice set in your car but these would be great as daily drivers and you can keep your nice set in good condition or perhaps you don't have a W210 55 and you could care less and you think these garbage things are just something you're not interested in option number two is $50 cash mail right to your door Option number three is three silver maple, one ounce, pure silver coins. Now these are in little airtight capsules. You can take it up out and everything, but these are from 2014. They're in very good condition. And uh, right now, if you've seen the price of silver, spot price is about $25 an ounce. And these regularly sell on eBay without an airtight for about 34 bucks. So you're looking at about, you know, $80, $90 worth of pure silver. So if that's something you're interested in, that's option three. So all you need to do to enter is once again, just like last month, you don't need to buy anything. Comment down below. First off, which one would you like? The floor mats, the silver, or $50 cash? And secondly, just tell me what your favorite Mercedes of all time is. Doesn't need to be one you own or one of mine or anything like that. So that pretty much wraps up this video. And uh, thank you all for watching. And until next time, bye for now.